And here we are. Hey everyone, it's Savaro Crescent here. And um, yeah, I'm doing Silent Hill. Where the ripping of flesh, the crushing of bone is most prominent. It should be fun. <laughs> yeah, I need to do that voice, don't I? Um, I've never actually played this one, to be honest. I've all, when it comes to Silent Hill, I'm not that very, I'm not very familiar with it, to be honest. Um, I do have a bit of a cold, so if I sniffle a bit and my voice is terrible, that could be the reason why. Yeah, it's, it's the 7th of January at the moment. It'll probably be a lot later by the time I upload this. But, um, yeah, I thought, why not? Because... I've never actually played this. It's always been other people playing this. Um, where uh, it, it was my mum that used to play all of these. She used to play all of them. And um, whenever she played them, because I was too young, I wasn't allowed to watch like her playing it or anything. So I only ever snuck in and saw little bits. But that was like when I was, I don't know, I think it was about, eight or nine by that time. I think this was 99 This uh, when this came out. I might be wrong, but I'm sure it's about 89. But yeah, a beautiful face in the background. But let's get this on. Let's get it on. <laughs> okay, maybe not that. I know there's, uh, cause my mum used to do this all the time. There's like a secret options thing 
but I think you had to complete the game where you can like edit how many things you pick up and stuff like that. But um, I think it was in the second game as well, but I've only played a bit of the second game as well. Like I got about halfway and then I don't know why I stopped playing. But the thing is, the, today's been quite a creepy day as well. It's been like a fucking ghost town where I live for some reason. Maybe because it's so cold today. So I thought, eh, let's make myself even more scared and play this game. Because I'm reaching into the unknown. Anyway, um, so if I do stumble and fumble like a fucking idiot, it's because I've never played this game before. Uh, easy, normal, or hard? Normal. Uh, what's going on? Was that like a loading screen? Shiro, where are you? Strange. It's quiet, too quiet. This place is like a ghost town. Pretty much where I live. Was that like a loading screen, Dad? Shiro! That's his voice now. That, that's the voice of everyone. Yami's voice from the bridge series. Or maybe just from normal Yu-Gi-Oh. Footsteps on the dance floor. I think that's the lyrics. Reminds me, baby, of you. I like how that is completely not his voice, the one that I was doing. Um, right, what about buttons? Okay, I can sidestep kind of like Tomb Raider. Can I, oh, I can run! Cool. I was kind of holding down square because I was like, eh, this is like Resident Evil, isn't it? And I'm pretty sure it's like that in the second game as well. Though there was a 3D mode in the second game where you can run pretty much 3D. I wonder if that's in this game as well, because that would come in handy. I guess not. <laughs> oh, so I have to deal with tank controls in this one. I'm probably one of the only people that used to the 3D controls. Well, that I know anyway. Right, what buttons have I got here? This kind of shifts the camera a little. There's, oh, right. It's kind of like a look-ish. I am liking the 3D camera, though, for a game like this. I don't have a map for this place. Maybe I should get one. Cheryl, is that you? Come here, you bitch. Come to... Am I a dad? <laughs> Come to daddy. Okay, that sounds really wrong. <laughs> Come to daddy, you bitch. Can I, um... Okay, I heard a gate then. Can I, um... Yes, I can. That, that's weird. I have to do it with the shoulder buttons. Yeah, I'm using a really old PS1 controller. Uh, the only way to play PS1 for me. I don't like the analog sticks for PS1 because they're a bit delayed it's before they really knew how to get it working. Oh well, this looks lovely. Um, I mean, look at this arrangement of bins. Beautiful. Not so keen on the blood. Or the whatever that is. 
What is that? Oh, even he's asking that. Jesus, what is that? It looks like blood. Mixed with some kind of... Pyramid looking thing. Maybe it's Pyramid Head before. Maybe this isn't a prequel. Oh, I'm not liking this camera angle. What's gonna go on here? What's. Oh. Oh. I feel like Han Solo. I got a bad feeling about this. Oh no. Why? Why with the camera angle? Usually a camera angle like that is never good. Oh, no. That's strange, it's getting darker. It's probably because it's night time. Better than nothing, I guess. Oh, this, no. Oh. My heart's already racing, I'm like, oh, it's, okay, it's raining now as well. Even better, shouldn't that be going out now, whatever, whatever I'm using. Light has never usually work that well. Why is the wheel going on that? A broken wheelchair? What's it, what's this doing here? Why is the wheel still moving? Did someone just violently push someone out of a wheelchair? But I can't find the body. Uh, what's with the... Uh... Why the music? What's this? What is any of this? Oh, fuck it, I just shit myself up with a gate. I was like, Jesus Christ, it's a gate. Let's me out. I'd rather not be in here anymore. Maybe I should mind crush people. Man. This is PS1 and it still looks really fucking creepy. And the music. The glorious synth music. Oh, stop. Uh, this is scarier than most horror games out now nowadays. It feels scarier than the second game, actually. Please don't. What is this? What's going on here? Uh. Oh fuck! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I can't. Oh no! This is not good. Oh shit! Um, do I have a weapon? I have fuck all, and I think I'm dying as well. I'm sure I was that green. What me for? God, this is ha at half one in the morning as well, and I'm playing this. Oh, wh what's happened to the gate? Blocked by a fence? Oh, shit. Well, I'm dead. What the? Oh, no! Get off me! I'm dead. Normal world didn't go very well. Was I dreaming? How do you feel? Oh, like I've been run over by a truck. But I'm alright, I guess. Glad to hear it. You from around here? Why don't you tell me what happened? Wait a second, I'm just a tourist. I came here for a vacation. I just got here. I don't know what happened. I'd like to find out myself. Uh -huh. 
Have you seen a little girl? Just turned seven last month, short, black hair. My daughter. Sorry. The only person I've seen in this town is you. Where is everybody? I'd tell you if I knew, believe me. But from what I can tell, something bizarre is going on. That's all I know. Hmm. What's your name? Harry. Harry Mason. Sybil Bennett. I'm a police officer from Brams, the next town over. The phones are all dead, and the radio too. I'm going back to call in some reinforcements. Hmm. Hold it. Where do you think you're going? My daughter. I've got to find her. No way. It's dangerous out there. In that case, I need to find her now. Cheryl's my little girl. I can't just leave her out there by herself. Have you got a gun? Um, no. Take this, and hope you don't have to use it. Now listen to me. Before you pull the trigger, know who you're shooting. And don't do it unless you have to. And don't go blasting me by mistake. Got it? Yeah, thanks. You do best to stay nearby. I'll be back with help as quick as I can. What the fuck kind of cop is that? Oh, do you have a gun? Um, no. There you go. Um, aren't you supposed to, like, stop civilians from having guns? You know what I mean? Anyway. Yeah, th I guess it was just fucking with me before, wasn't it? Um, well, at least I have a weapon now. 50 bullets. Um, I think I should keep hold of that. Well, I'm, I'm not going to throw it away, am I? But, um, I'd, I don't know. Should I equip it? Should I unequip it? I'll equip it. Right. I oh, it's R2. Right, alright. And I'm assuming it's Resident Evil. That is cool. That's better than Resident Evil. <laughs> Straight off. Being able to walk while you've got your gun out. Um, not too keen on the sidestep, though. <laughs> like, I love Resident Evil, but I will admit that is far better. Being able to walk while you're aiming. Oh, that's all this shit. Elf drink? Um, yes. Do you see how fast I died before? Flashlight, yes. I think I'll need that. Is this a map? Yes. There is a residential area map. Take it? Yes, I'll take it hard. I want to play on the pinball machine. Nothing unusual, though, about it. Someday, someone may experience these bizarre events. Hopefully... Hopefully they will find my notes useful. His voice is getting slightly more and more darker. It is actually hard for me to speak at the moment because of this cold that I've got. That could be why it feels like I'm slurring a bit. I'm not pissed. I am just drunk. Nah. <laughs> uh, I'm just ill.
like usual, I've got a brilliant belt. Do you like it? Yes, dance for me. Right, how do I use my flashlight? I probably don't need to, but I want to know how to. I can't use it! One touch on and off switch fits in my breast pocket. Look at my tits. <laughs> Look at my breasts. Aren't they beautiful? Oh, more health. That would do. A kitchen knife, yeah, whatever. I want the health. Uh, how effective would the kitchen knife be, actually? That's what I want to know. I'm not going to go Resident Evil style knife only. Because I'm not that good. I'm not even good at Resident Evil. I usually die a lot. So this is probably going to be a great addition to my playthroughs. What is this? A radio seems broken. Can't hear anything. Oh, turn it on, man. There's an on-off switch. Use it. Volume? Maybe? Change the radio station? Okay. What's that? Huh. Radio. What's going on with that radio? Oh, great. Oh, no! <laughs> uh, I don't think a knife is going to work in this situation. <laughs> Okay, maybe it is best to use the gun. Turn around, man! Get off me! You can't even aim for shit! Get... Just get over there! Turn around! Oh, for fuck's sake! Have I got it? Can this I get it? Dream. Oh. What's happening to this place? It doesn't help you took like 50,000 hits from the first enemy. And you're nearly dead! Well done. Fucking fantastic. How many bullets have I got? I know I used a lot because he wouldn't fucking aim at the thing. Seven. So I used eight bullets. Oh wait, did I have 14 or 15 bullets? I can't remember. I had bullets. They're all gone now. Well, this isn't going beautifully. The, there is a pocket radio. Take it. Yes. I think I'll avoid most things. Because I don't think there's any reason to fight things, is there? Well, it is a survival horror. Oh, fuck it. Save. Right, let's do this. I probably could have redone that and then saved again. Knowing what I actually had to do. But, um, there's probably no reason now. Where could Cheryl have gone? I guess I'll check that alley again. No, don't fucking check that alley again. You died last time. You fucking dumbass. You died. Great, we're going to the alley. Again. Should I um, turn that radio on? Oh, it's already on. Why can't I use that? I can't see shit in this place. I mean, look at all that fog. So if an enemy starts flying at me, I'm just going to run off. Because I can't handle it right at this moment. I need a better weapon, for one. No! There's an enemy! I don't know where it is. Oh no, where is it? Oh my god, it's behind me! No! Get away from me! You don't want me! Okay, that was pretty successful. Uh, I hear something else. Oh no! No! Dogs! Oh my god! No! <laughs> Don't run into a wall, you fucking knob. 